Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Roly again. How are you guys doing? Again, Chocolate wanted to join us for this video. So obviously he's already making his little cameo. Um, I'm not sure how much Chocolate will come out, but obviously he's already part of the video and he seems to be wanting to be part of my channel more and more so. Hola a todos, mi nombre es Roly. Bienvenidos otra vez a mi canal. Vamos a hacer un unboxing, un video de BoxyCharm para el video de diciembre. Um, again, this is the December issue for BoxyCharm. Um, y como ya vieron, mi perro va a estar en el video a lo mejor un poquito. Um, no sé cuánto ahorita está sentado enseguida de mí, pero nos ha metido otra vez a la cámara. Um, again, this time around, I didn't look up any sneak peeks because I wanted to just get the box and then just open it. Um, so, let's see what I got. Um, este... Mes otra vez no vi de, no vi ningún, um, o sea, sneak peek de lo que fuera este mes y lo que iban a poner, como a veces sí veo en el Instagram que ponen diferentes fotos de la variedad. Um, esta vez <coughs> se me olvidó hacerlo. So, vamos a ver qué agarré. Again, guys, you just saw me um, slice that little thing open. So, let's see what we have in here this month. Ooh, this little card. It's all cute and like fallish. Chocolate's like literally sitting on me. Like he's being so annoying. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, how cute. So I got the Storybook Cosmetics Fairy Tales Robin Hood palette. Um, it's inspired by the classic tale. This storybook mini palette was created exclusively for BoxyCharm. Um, and it is as beautiful as the inside as it is on the outside. We've combined stunning metallics and velvety matte eyeshadows to help you create a, to help you create your happily ever after look. Look at this packaging. Like, that is so cute. Um, obviously there's the ingredients for each color. Um, and it looks like each color has some sort of I don't know there's like a lot of stuff back there so yeah Ooh, and so look guys this is a little mirror and here are the shades not bad six shades so the shades are made marion then we have quiv quiver forest nottingham Merry Men, and of course, Robin Hood, which is super, super cute. This is worth $35. Um, the next thing that we have here is the item I was able to choose. This month, you were able to choose, I think, one item. There was a survey that they sent out. The one that I choose what chose was, where is this? Oh, here it is. So the one that I chose was this, the Elemis Pro Cop. Pro Collagen Rose Facial Oil, a luxurious and lightweight facial, lightweight facial oil infused with a precious trio of rose extracts to help smooth the look of fine lines and wrinkles, leaving the skin with a luminous glow. And this is the packaging. So cute. This was worth $79, which is crazy expensive. Um, it has a little... Um, let me open it just so we can see what it looks like on the inside. And then it has a little dropper. So it says that this, you massage three to four drops over the face and neck. Um, apparently, if contact with the eyes occurs, it says to rinse thoroughly. So don't get it in your eyes. <laughs> but this is really well worth the price um, because now they've raised the price for BoxyCharm. Um, it used to be just $21, now it's $25. And you can upgrade your box to something else if you want for a little bit more. So again, the little Storybook Cosmetics was $35. This was $79, which we've already gotten our value back like way a long time ago. The next thing that we have is the Ciate Marbled Light Illuminating Blusher. It says here that we're going to add a radiant flush of color to your complexion with marbled light illuminating blush. Formulated without talc, this lightweight buildable formula has a blend of matte pigments and finely milled illuminating particles. This was worth $26, which 
this is worth, I mean, the whole entire box that I paid for, which is awesome. Ooh, cute. This kind of reminds me of a little, like, compact, like, kind of like this show, Totally Spies, um, kind of like, maybe like Sailor Moon vibes too. I don't know, but it's super cute. This was worth $24 and it is a little blush. Um, I didn't get any of my wipes, makeup wipes to like actually swatch anything. So that was my bad, but um, yeah, sorry guys. <laughs> but I should have done that and I'm sorry. I should have really been thought about this more, but I was excited to just film a video for you guys because I haven't filmed anything in a little while, which I should be actually working on stuff while I'm not filming or doing anything else, right? The next thing that I have here was the Seraphine Botanicals um, lip, exf lip Exfoliator with Radish Extract. Um, okay, that's interesting. So this is a gentle lip scrub infused with radish, chamomile extracts, as well as chia seed oil to keep lips smooth. Okay, I already ruined how to open this. Um, cleansed and conditioned, this unique blend of soft golden sugar in a healthy base of avocado, apricot, and jojoba oils as well as shea and cocoa butters further help protect lips from any further chopping um, or flaking and it has a little thing here for you to open it up and then just um, put it on your lips i'm assuming directions use your ring finger gently buff onto lips into a circular motion rinse with cold or wipe with a wet tissue to reveal the smoothest skin ever which I think I feel like I need this only because it's already been like getting cold here in Texas where I'm at um, and it just like suddenly changes all the time so I definitely need to be using this more um, and sorry guys that's my dog moving something in his cage just making unnecessary sounds but it's okay um, this was worth $24 and then the marbled light uh, little brush uh, blush thing was worth $26 um, so the last thing that we have here is Ivy Beauty um, Feather, Feather Matte Liquid Lipstick. Feather Matte's smooth and lightweight formula provides a comfortable creamy texture for lips um, that lasts through these long meetings or fun date nights in the city. Mark your lips in two incredible shades. So I got the shade, I think it said it was nude. Yeah, so nude. Um, it says here that this is cruelty-free and vegan as well. Um, okay. It smells interesting. Not bad. Um, and this was worth $9. So I would have swatched this for you guys, but um, I don't have any of those makeup wipes with me right now. So like, I feel like I'm going to ruin everything. Mm. Yeah, well, uh, let's just do it. Whatever. So this is going to be the Nude Feather Matte. And let's see how that dries. But just so you guys could see, it is nude, I guess. I don't know. That seems kind of dark. We'll see how that dries. That looks kind of dark. Um, so then we had this little blush as well. And let's swatch this one. Um, we'll use this here. Cute. It's definitely shiny. You can barely see anything. Hmm. Let's try that again. Um, it's very, very, very slight, but it's definitely going to be something you have to build up for sure. So that was that. Um, I guess we'll go into this storybook little palette and show you guys maybe a swatch or two of these. Well, all of them. Um, so let's start with the finger that I didn't use. So I use this finger here. Uh, we're going to check Maid Marian. Ooh, this is buttery. That's pretty. 
We're gonna do a quiver. This is up there. It's like really, really close to my skin tone, but it's there. Um, the next one was Nottingham, right here. Ooh, that's very, very buttery. Oh, where is that? Oh, it's there. Here. So they're very close to my sh skin tone, guys. So sorry. And then this is the color Forest. These swatches are not that great. Sorry. Um, then we have the color Merry Men. So we're going to have to do that over here. I already forgotten about that. Uh, still looks weird. Merry Men. Cute. This one was really, really smooth too. And then the last color was Robin Hood. Ooh, that is pretty. Yes. And there you guys have it. Those are the Storybook Cosmetics color. Um, and then this little oil, just because my fingers are all dirty now, um, I'm not gonna like put it on or anything like that. But I did at least want to show you guys the colors. Um, there's a little bit of a a little bit of the blush, but they're, the shades are right here. This one is super, super, super close to my skin tone. Um, this one I know I could have done better. Probably better too, obviously. Yeah, better. <laughs> but next time, I'll plan better. Um, and then there's these two shades that I definitely swatched really well. Um, that nude, though, mm, I don't know how I'm feeling about this thing. It just seems kind of dark for me, but it is what it is. Um, again, guys, I just wanted to show you guys this video. Uh, quería ver que quería enseñarles el video de lo que iba a agarrar este mes de boxy charm. Um, and guys, I hope you enjoy these videos. Um, thank you guys again for your support, just for keeping up with me um, and listening to my little rants here on YouTube. Um, I know I haven't been as active as I want to, but I've been going through some stuff as far as like changes. Um, I'm finally in moving into my own apartment that I was like, you know what, I just need to get it. I need to be close to my job, which right now my job and where I'm living is super, super far away, which ugh, driving is so annoying. Um, and if I didn't have to drive, I wouldn't. But anyways, um, doing something for me, self-care, self-love, which is all about um, just taking care of who I am, my mental health and what I'm about. Uh, again, Thank you guys for taking the time for watching this video and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your week. Um, if I have any other videos that I'm working on, obviously I will be uploading them very soon. Um, as of right now, I haven't planned anything, but um, it's not like I can't plan anything and then just do it. Again, thank you guys so much for watching. Gracias esta vez por ver el video. Sé que esta vez no hablé mucho español, pero igual um, muchas gracias por tan siquiera verlo. Um, igual... Um, Gracias por estar aquí también a oír todo lo que estoy haciendo y las cosas que he estado cambiando en mi vida. Um, al fin tengo un apartamento que yo fui, lo agarré, uh, lo encontré y es algo que lo estoy haciendo por mí. Porque es, eso es lo que se trata de las cosas que me hacen a mí feliz y que yo quiero hacer por mí. Bueno, gracias, guys, por ver el video. Adiós.